we have a tragic story to begin with today. A 16-month-old girl has died after being attacked by the family's dogs in Akron on Sunday. And this evening, police are still investigating the incident to determine if anyone will be facing charges. Brandon Simmons joins us now with more on the details of what happened in this story. Brandon, this is just heartbreaking. Yeah, really a heartbreaking story here, uh, Betsy. It doesn't get much worse than this, really. Uh, I just want to say that we know that the family was destroyed. This, according to police, after this tragic incident that they had to respond to yesterday. And really, they're still trying to figure it all out. I do want to walk you through exactly what happened. The little girl, 16-month-old Kavay Lewis, was dropped off at this Westmoreland Street home yesterday morning to stay with her 20-year-old uncle who was babysitting for the day. And around 10.30 yesterday morning, a female acquaintance showed up at the front door and the two got into an argument in the front porch area of the home and began to fight. Now, neighbors called police about the altercation, but little did they know what was happening inside the home at the same time was really much worse. While they were outside the home engaged in uh, this altercation, uh, the little girl was left inside the house with uh, the two family pets. It's believed that the do dogs reacted and turned their aggression to this beautiful 16-month-old little girl. Now, Kave was taken to the hospital, but she did die from her injuries. And police say they're still investigating to determine whether or not anyone will be charged, acknowledging that the family was devastated and that no one really wanted this to happen to Kave. Now, the two dogs, both pit bulls, have been removed from the home by Summit County Animal Control, where they remain this evening. And I do want to point out, this isn't the first incident involving these two animals. They were involved over the summer in a case where they were said to have attacked the mail carrier in that neighborhood. Uh, we're going to have more coming up on six on what matters most about that story and what neighbors have to say about it. Betsy. Certainly a lot of questions still to get answers to. Thanks so much, Brandon, for staying on the story.